<laughs> you did mention um your play that is coming really soon. And I just feel like that's a great segue into you, you know, sharing more about the play. So what is it about? When is it taking place? Where is it going to be? All of those good things. The name of the stage play that we are currently in pre-production for is called Crucified. Crucified is going to premiere April 14th and 15th at the Slayton House in Columbia, Maryland. It is, oh, Crucified is a very deep, deep show. And it's crazy because we did the read through yesterday. <laughs> when everyone started off reading it had so much energy so much stamina but it's like as we got to the midpoint of the show you know where you know a lot of things start to take place you could feel the momentum go down and i'm like y'all pick it back up they're like we're trying to process everything that's in here crucified is about a young young woman's battle with addiction and along the way, as she's battling with addiction, she uh, resurfaces childhood trauma. But really, she comes to the realization that a lot of her drinking came from her childhood trauma. <laughs> it, it was a way of her to ignore it, to escape from it. Basically, the story is about me. It's about me and the things that I went through um, as far as dealing with uh, a childhood trauma that, you know, something that was constantly, repeatedly told to me over and over and over and over again <laughs> throughout my whole life. And I never realized how much I had built up inside of me because of that. Like, I, I just always thought that it was like, it is what it is. Um, but eventually, you know, I had so much built up and then uh, indulging into alcohol and things of that nature things to a whole new level a whole new extreme and it, it's very un unfortunate but i decided to write crucify because i want to be that person to help the next person who is going through what they may feel like is the end of their life like it's like this is not the end of your life by any means far necessary because if i can tell y'all all the things that i went through i was basically like crucified okay i'm um, talking about crucified throughout my family throughout the neighborhood could you imagine everyone in your neighborhood and in your family like just against you literally like they literally put me on the cross and burned me okay because i was being accused of a heinous act <laughs> what one would consider as murder i did crucify because it's like well if i could overcome all of these things you know, and the main character Yoshi plays is, is really, uh, she, she's portraying my life. If I can overcome all of these things, then so can you. And that's what I really want a person to take away from Crucified. I want to be able to save a life because people have worries. They have silent moments that we don't know about and they have a smile on their face and they're walking around with a smile on their face and you don't know like they could be sitting in the audience like man after this show I'm, that's it i'm done but if watching the show could just change one mind you know then i feel like we have definitely served our purpose and did the show justice so that's what crucified is about it's it's, it's really deep it's really powerful and it's going to shed light and bring light to a lot of people. That's what I'm a host for. And we're going beyond the 14th and 15th of April, baby. We taking this on the top, all right? <laughs>